you hit up um let's see here i wanted to get this right the uh uh ops 36 teaching program so what what do you what do you do with that it sounds pretty interesting yeah so um we've been doing it for two years actually july made two years that we started um and actually my brother he's also a golf professional tommy hines um but he moved to china he said the island's too small <laughs> for two years to teach <laughs> anyway um, so we started Operation 36. It's, it's a great program. Everyone that starts, doesn't matter what caliber, you would start playing from 25 yards out, shooting 36 or better. Next time out, you go from 50, 100, and you go all the way back, and you can keep going back to the forward tees, middle tees, and the back tees. Um, it's a six-week program that I run. We go over 12 skills, putting, green reading, um, power, alignment, ball flight, um, exercise and nutrition. Wow. Um, so we cover all of that. But the best part of the program is actually getting these new golfers out on the golf course. And we know um, the game is right around the putting green, um, normally about 75 yards in. That's where it all counts. I was just listening to one of the greatest basketball players of all time, uh, on Instagram, uh, Michael Jordan, uh, just come. What do you mean, one of the best? Isn't he the well, best? Well, that's arguable. Come on. But make a long story short, <laughs> he took up golf. Okay, he wanted another challenge, and yeah. he said it's the most challenging game he's ever played. It is, and it's funny because you know we we interview some of the greatest athletes on the planet for the last thirty years or so with the show, and they seem like it's harder to hit a still ball than a moving ball, and that's it's what I love. I guess it makes you humble. I guess. Yeah, well, Michael Jordan actually played our course um, when we were the West End, and I got to meet him, and um, it was it was fun. Uh, but yeah, he was challenged out here when we had the KLA golf course. Yeah.